O ke awi ka huli vela ka honua, O ke awi ka huli lole kalani, O ke awi ku ka ia ka kala, E ho o malama lama i ka malama, O ke awa o makali i ka po, O ka vale vale ho o kumu honua ia, O ke kumu o ka lipo i lipo ai, O ke kumu o ka po i ipo ai, O ka lipo lipo, O ka lipo lipo, O ka lipo ka la, O ka lipo ka po, Po vale ho i ha nau ka po, Ha nau kumu lipo i ka po o he kane, Hānau pō ele i ka pō he wahine. Born is pō, or darkness, then time, space, and heat that created us and the universe. Then born are the stars, made up of the same energy that we are. The stars are the ancestors of all. O nā kumu aku a pau i hānau i ka pō i ka lāhi ki ku, ea mai ke kai mai. From the sea arose coral, our first life form here on earth. Then born were the sea creatures, and then the swimmers, those that take flight, the creepers and crawlers, the pig-like animals, dog, and then the dog, man's best friend. The Kumulipo is the genealogy of the Hawaiian people. It starts from pre-mortal darkness, the conception of the cosmos, the creation of the Hawaiian islands, and then the evolution of Hawaii and the Hawaiian people. Hānau lai lai hewahine o keli i wahi lani kāna kāne. Hānau mai kā laua o ki i ka mua. Hānau mai o kāne. Hānau kāna loa. Born is lai lai, a female, our first human ancestor, our great kupuna wahine, who walked the lands of Lalawaya over 1,200 generations ago. He ali i ka aina he kawā ke kanaka. Land is the chief and people are but its servants. Humans should not dominate the natural world. Instead, we should be working in balance to create a familial collect connection with the environment. Some examples of the abuse of land is the US mil military used some of these islands and places to test their military weapons and sometimes forces the native inhabitants of those islands to move. Somehow, through the teaching and brainwashing of Euro-Americans, we have lost and abandoned our connection to the land. We are hurting the ancestors that which nourish us. Whether it's allowing major corporations to do science projects on our food and spray pesticides and herbicides, or desecrate a mountain that's held sacred to the Hawaiian people, or even allowing major corporations to steal our water from public trust and make it unable for Hawaiian or farmers in those places to sustain themselves and provide for their families. The way I was raised, I was taught from a very young age that um, I'm but a servant to the land. On the right, this is my, or your guys' left, this is my grandfather who plants kalo in Kahakuloa Valley. Unfortunately, he was born into the generation that wasn't able to learn to speak his native tongue, which is Hawaiian. I was privileged enough to get to be born into this generation and join the Kulakayapuni program, which is Hawaiian immersion. When we die, our, body, our bones and our bodies become part of the soil that nourishes us. We tread on the bones of our ancestors. One day, my Evie, your Evie, and the bones of your children will join them. By caring for and nurturing the land, instead of relying on imported foods, we should be coming up with ways to sustain ourselves and be able to provide for our families. Land is not a commodity. It is not real estate. We are descendants of the earth, and it can sustain, nourish, and feed us. Fundamentally, the cosmos, the galaxies, the planets, the islands, the mountains, the oceans, we are all connected. We all have one mo'okuauhau, or genealogy. We all, whether 
animate or inanimate are related. We all share one hulukupuna or beloved ancestors, one genealogy, and one kuleana to the land, which is to aloha aina. This is the fundamental na'awau or wisdom of our kupuna that has been passed down from generation to generation. We have a kuleana, duty and responsibility to share life, lokahi, um, kuleana, and that is the true meaning of aloha. Aloha aina for all our ohana, that all that nourishes, feeds, and shelters us, and sustains our aina, and with oya i'o, or genuine truth. So I'm going to leave you guys with a song that um, a family member of mine wrote that empowers my culture and my lahui. Let us all celebrate our, our ancestors and relation to the cosmos. Aloha aina oya i o mahalo.